Stop! That's not how we do things here. I'm at Curtin. Now what? Welcome to another episode of I'm at Curtin. Now what? I'm Devna. And I'm Dan. And today we're going to let Devna try some of these snacks. Have you tried many Australian snacks before? Um, I've tried Vegemite before, but it's like three years ago, so I am kind of forgot uh, how it tastes. Okay, well I'll make you a Vegemite sandwich, you'll be able to try it again. Cool! I'm so excited about this episode. Let's go! Okay, Devna, this is fairy bread. It's effectively just sugar on bread. It's pretty toasty, very sweet. But it's colourful, I like it. Yeah, it's got a nice name. Can fairy we try it? Yeah, definitely. Mm. Mmm, it's so sweet. I love the texture. It gave a crunchy texture. It's been so long since I've had this, I forgot how crunchy it was. When last time you have this food? Probably primary school. It's a primary school food. You mm. have it a lot at parties. I think as an adult, effectively, you give it to the kids, they get all hot with sugar, and then you give the kids back their parents. Mmm, and this is basically bread, and then you put like butter? Yeah, butter, margarine, and then um, hundreds of thousands. I think it's really good to start your day with this friend. <laughs> yeah, the perfect nutritious start to the day. Out of five, how would you rate this food? Um, to start my morning, I'm gonna rate like four out of five. I like it. I like sweet. Okay, so this one is sort of a snack. Some biscuits with a cheese dip. So basically how you eat it, do you spread it or do you like... Dip you dip it. it yes. Oh, dip it. Yep. Okay, we'll try. Cheers! <laughs> Cheers! Mmm. Mmm. It's like a normal cracker, but I can taste a little bit of sweet and salty. And I'm crazy about cheese, so... Yeah, me too. Love cheese. I think though, um, for the amount of cheese that I put on a cracker, there's not enough cheese. This would always be in my lunchbox, even going into high school. It's easy. There's no mess, simple to eat, tasty. I'm gonna rate this food probably like 3 out of 5 because it's just like a normal basic snack. But I love how they produce the cheese because it's not like a smelly cheese. It's kind of savory cheese but it's also light. It's an Aussie snack with a French name, Le Snack. This is a sponge cake coated in chocolate and desiccated coconut. It's called a lamington. Lamington? Yep. Although you can get it in different flavors. So it comes chocolate or strawberry. Can I find the snacks everywhere in Australia? Yeah, I reckon you can get this at any supermarket. Oh, okay. Mmm. There's a like sponge cake and then they have a layer of like jam. The cake itself, it's uh, sweet and I love when they put like coconut on top, it gives more texture. It's a bit crunchy, but it's also soft and sweet and chocolate. I love lamington so much. When do you usually eat this snack? Uh, this would be an afternoon tea or a morning tea snack. I'd probably have it with a coffee or a tea. Maybe this snack's gonna be my pre-workout <laughs> before going to the gym. I'm gonna rate 4.5 out of 5. I see you're running thin. You really like your sweet snacks. Yeah, I really love it. Sweet is the key answer of all your problems. <laughs> so, I see this biscuit before because I actually bring the snacks to Indonesia for my mom, but I never try it. So yeah, this is an Anzac biscuit. It's gonna be another crunchy one. Okay. Should we do an ASMR? Oh yeah. It's not like all salty, but they have a sweet taste. So I can taste a little bit of like coconut, oats. All of the biscuit is crispy, so there's no like soft part of the biscuit. It's a biscuit that's um, used to fundraise for veterans. It's especially sold around Anzac Day. Originally, they were made uh, by the soldiers' wives and sent over. So the ingredients had to be available because it was rationing and they had to keep because it had to like stay fresh by like, being posted. By law, it is a biscuit, not a cookie. You cannot call it a cookie. You cannot call it a cookie. I gave um, four out of five. Wow, Tim Tam. I've tried it before, but why there's a milk? Have you had a Tim Tam slam? 
Tim Tam's lab. What's that? I, I'm not gonna tell you what it is. I'm just gonna make you do it. Okay. Sweet. So, what should I do? This is a very simple process. You take the Tim Tam. Take the Tim Tam. You bite the end off. Bite the end off? Mm -hmm. Both sides. Alright. Now you use it as a straw to drink the milk. As a straw? Wow, I can literally use it as a straw. Yeah. I was straw. I never tried this before. I never tried this way, like how to eat proper tim tam. So it's great with milk, but you can also do it with a hot drink, like a coffee or a hot chocolate. Um, I'd say it's probably better with a hot drink, but then also the heat makes the tim tam fall apart. Oh, yeah. oh my god, I was shocked. I tried tim tam before, but I never eat it this way. I love it because. When you don't like add milk, the Tim Tam is gonna be like crunchy. But when you combine it and you drink it with the milk, it's gonna be make the Tim Tam soft, and it's gonna be tone down the sweetness of the chocolate. For the Tim Tam itself, without milk, I'm probably gonna rate like three out of five. But when you tell me the way to eat Tim Tam, it's gonna be like four point five out of five. Like Tim Tam is already a good snack, but a Tim Tam slam. It's another level. You need to experience this. Okay, so I'm gonna make two Vegemite sandwiches. Vegemite sandwiches, okay. Yep, one of them is gonna have the right amount of Vegemite, and then the other one is gonna have way too much, as if you were making a Nutella sandwich. And then we're gonna play rock, paper, scissors. Whoever wins gets to blindly pick which sandwich they have. Good luck. So this one's got about the right amount of Vegemite. This one's edible and will taste good. This is too much. Rock, paper, scissors. Yes! <laughs> wow. But producers already like mix the bread, so we doesn't know which one is the correct amount of Vegemite in that bread. Yeah, it is a blind choice. So I'm gonna choose um, the right one. So, so you pick right, I get left? Yeah. Uh, uh. <laughs> I, um, one, two, three. Mm. Mm. I think I got the wrong one. Why? Oh my god. With butter and on bread, it's definitely better than eating a scoop of it. Oh. Mm. I think it's too much. You wanna try the right? Yeah, uh -huh. sure. So I'm gonna try the correct amount of Vegemite. Mmm. Now I can tell the difference. And each person will have a different amount that they like. Maybe for me personally, I'm gonna put more butter and a little bit of Vegemite. Because the butter actually toned down how Vegemite actually tastes. If you put correct amount of Vegemite, I'm gonna give like 3 out of 5. But if you put too much Vegemite, I'm gonna... Sorry guys, it's 0 yeah. out of 5. Unedible. <laughs> I'm so full now. The Australian snack, it is incredible. Now I need to burn some calories. Should we go run? We should definitely go for a run. Yeah, hopefully you guys learned something today. And if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let us know in the comment what other type of content you love to see about international students' life at Curtin. See, see ya! ya.